watch every video I'm starting this in the car. I'm on my way to Amsterdam again. This time to the Armada Music Offices to pick up someone special. Uh, there's a reason why I'm wearing this cap. Because uh, this weekend, Raj is releasing his album High On Life. And uh, I thought it would be a good idea to dedicate this vlog to him. And uh, to do that, I'm going to pick him up and we're going to see a football game tonight. And we're just gonna have some fun and I'm gonna ask him some questions about, uh, about the album. And I'm going to share that with you. So let's go. We just got to the Armada offices, it's right over there. And look who's here. <laughs> it's Rog! So since everybody forgets how to drive when it's raining in the Netherlands, we might as well ask the questions right now. Here he is, Rog, welcome. This is not the coffee run, this is just because we're in traffic. <laughs> and we might as well coffee ask run. questions right now. So, um, first of all, Rog, why high on life? The title is being high on all the fun things you do like in life. Could, could be like amazing shows I'm doing with, as, an, as, a, as an artist or traveling or but it could also be like grabbing beers with friends or so uh, basically chilling out at home with my cat. Yeah. <laughs> cat. So okay. basically the album is about having fun. Uh, yeah. Okay, so now High on Life is off the bucket list. What's, what's coming up next? Um, what's coming up next? Yeah, that's a, that's a good question. I'm uh, trying to focus on a, on a, new, a new project moment I can't wait I can't, <laughs> I can't I can't tell the so, so much about yeah because yeah, it needs it needs to get yeah we need to get done so okay time for some uh, some some typical questions that you always hear in interviews but it's interesting to know where did you get the inspiration from for making the album oh yeah that was actually a question I got in via Twitter where did I got yeah I can't I can't name where basically it was like everywhere around the world everywhere when I've been in the last year or so. Definitely, Ibiza was uh, quite an inspiration for a couple of records. Uh, and I saw another question coming from Jess. Yeah, let's go. That's right. Uh, I would ask him, how excited are you today? <laughs> well, I'm very excited because we're on our way to a football match. Yes, excited. <laughs> no, but seriously, tomorrow my album is releasing. That's, I'm crazy excited. Yeah, but also scared as fuck actually. <laughs> <laughs> Because it's, it's it's all gonna be like out there, and I, I hope I, just, I hope people will like it. Yeah, a good faith, but still it's scary. Another another typical question: Which uh, tune of the album is your absolute favorite and means the most to you, and why? Definitely high on life. Why? I don't know. It's it's just a, it's some kind of magical feeling in the record. I'm actually always searching for, but I'm not always able to. Uh, it out while producing music so yeah I'm very happy with the record okay this is, has nothing to do with uh, with the album but it has to do with your music uh, when I work out I listen I listen to uh, Roger radio um, is there a plan to launch that like official radio show and um, can we get more frequent shows please what you mean like every week show yeah, maybe or even more <laughs> <laughs> no, no, seriously, like uh, maybe bi-weekly or... Um, well, at the moment I actually find... Uh, I'm, I'm actually having a hard time to gather enough tracks each month that, that fit the feeling I'm searching for, actually, so... Try starting a weekly radio show, man. The struggle is real. Yeah, I can, <laughs> I can totally imagine. Yeah. So, more frequent than once a month. Sometimes it's hard for me to, to pick like 10 or 12 records that are new, fit the style, fit each other in a mix, and still, yeah, it's, it's, it's hard already. So. Okay. so no plans for that actually at the moment. Maybe that will change, I hope, because that means that there will be more awesome music being released, or I'm, I'm discovering more amazing music than I do right now. That would be a great thing. So your uh, touring schedule is picking up as well. What is your next gig? Next gig, ne next gig is going to be in the Netherlands. So it's not too much of a tour. But it's going to, I, I'm super excited for it. It's going to be the first statement night. Hey! 
yeah, super excited for that. It's gonna be fun. Ruben is playing, uh, David Gravel is playing, as well as Estiva, which I'm, um, yeah. He's been on fire lately. Yeah, seriously, I'm a big fan of the guys. Music is amazing. So, last but not least, uh, a message to uh, everybody watching. <laughs> Uh, yeah, hey, thanks for the support so far already. Yeah, what, 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 what kind of cheesy shit do I have to say? Make now? it as cheesy yeah, as yeah, possible. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> thanks for the support so far. I, I'm getting a lot of yeah, love from people from all over the world, which is well, truly amazing. It's, yeah, it makes it all worth it and also gives great energy to make even more music. So, yeah, thanks for that. Yeah. And remember guys, he's only getting started. <laughs> Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time for the for a new vlog. Bye bye. How healthy are we? Huh? How healthy are we? We're eating very clean man today. Healthy. Oh. <laughs>